out what the fuck is up. We are back. We are back. Um, You're back. Nice to see you again. I'm back. I'm leaving, dude. What is this? I need to travel to Hogsmeade. I should be able to find Sirena inside of Treads. Oh, it's like right here. Oh, sure. Okay, Hello there. Nice to see you. Hello, Miss Ryan. I wanted to thank you again for your help with Rookwood and Harlow the day of the troll attack. Serona, please. And I was happy to help. Oh, those two are nothing but trouble. Glad you and your friend were here when they found you. I am too. You were speaking to a goblin here that day. Yes, Lodgog. <sighs> He's a friend. It seemed as though you were on good terms with him. I've known him for years. We met when I was waiting tables here as a student, well before I bought the place. He was cordial enough, but we weren't friends then. His mistrust of wizard kind ran deep. But you're friends now? We are. I hadn't seen him in years when he came in a few months ago. But he recognized me instantly, which is more than I can say for some of my own classmates. It took them a second to realize I was actually a witch, not a wizard. Not all goblins are like Ranrock and his loyalists. Lodgok is as worried as the rest of us about what's been going on. In that case, I'd like to talk with him, about Ranrock in particular. Where might I find him? I assume your interest is to do with the rumors I've heard about Ranrock working with our friend Rookwood. It is. If he's not here, you might find him doing business at the Hog's Head. He's a trusted metal trader. You should mention that we spoke. He can, understandably, be wary of witches and wizards. Even ones as young as you. That okay. said, if you're looking for information on Ranrock to help rein him in, you'll find an ally in Lodgok. Thank you, Serona. If you find Lodgok, please give him my best. I don't know what you've done to make such powerful enemies, but please, watch your back. All right. Look for Log Logog at the Hog's Head Inn. Hello. Good to see you outside the castle. Who the fuck are you? Welcome to the Hog's Head. Any empty seat is yours. Hello, Logog. Serona said I might find you here. She did, did she? Did she send you with news? No, actually, I wanted to speak with you. It's about Ranrock. Now I remember. The three broomsticks. Day of the troll attack. You're the student he's after. I am, and I need to know what he and his loyalists are up to, so I can stay a step ahead. Let's say I did know. Why should I trust you? Serona trusts me. And she said she thought our interests may be aligned. Hmm. Well, if Serona trusts you, very well. I may know of something that could help us both. A way to get Ranrock to confide his plans to me. I'm listening. Years ago, a heinous witch stole a sacred goblin relic. Rumor has it that it now rests in her sarcophagus, in a tomb accessible only by wizard kind. Okay. Ranrock and I had a, a falling out a while back. The relic could well repair the chasm between us. Very well. I'll retrieve the relic if you promise to share Ranrock's plans with me. We will have to trust each other. I, that you will not abscond with the relic, and you, that I'll share what I learn. Gather whatever supplies you may need and meet me near the witch's tomb. Uh, log, logog near the witch's tomb. I mean, you know, I don't think it would be they would set me up, but you never know. I'm ready. Good. There's no time to lose. 
What precisely is the relic I'm to retrieve? A valuable heirloom known as the Helmet of Ertgot. The witch considered herself a collector and purchased the helmet as a trinket. She cared not what pain she caused the goblins. Goblins believe that the rightful owner of any object is its maker, not its purchaser. Wizard kind sees things differently. It's a wonder goblins and wizards have ever been able to work together. The differences between our kinds are myriad. They seem to be. <coughs> Enemies. It may surprise you to know that I do not believe those differences always to be insurmountable. It is the reason I find myself traveling with you to this tomb today. What the fuck is that? Wolves? Or is wolves? Oh my god, we could have sprinted? Oh my god. Oh, Merlin's trial. And there it is, the witch's rebellion. Oh, dreadful looking place, isn't it? Hey, there we go. I wish you luck retrieving the helmet. As a wand carrier, you should have an advantage. Now, before you set off, do you have any questions? No, I'm good. It all seems clear to me now that we're here. I do hope our alliance proves fruitful. Again, I wish you luck. I will remain here, eagerly awaiting your return. Oh, man. It's sealed. Oh. Moths. Curious. Lumos. Right here? Wait, what? Merlin's beard? Oh, a ceramic mask? This can't be the witch's tomb. Likely I need to go further. Oh, we need two more? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Spoilers. What the fuck? Everyone must be struck with fire spells to make them vulnerable to other attacks. Okay. Say less. Oh, 
so that's where I get it. The skull material. Um. Revenia. What? Oh, is this something I could drag? Rebellion. Lumos. There you are. What is this? Maybe right there. Hmm. If I could power it somehow, it looks like it could be rotated. I mean, I literally just did it. Let's go. Come on now. Get my loot, dude. Oh, like, especially right now, I need as much loot as possible. Continue over here. Ah, oh, this looks like a fight. There's still more. Jeez. 
Jesus. Okay, so where are we taking you? Uh, oh. <laughs> Jesus. comes over here maybe there's something up here that I could use I was supposed to hit it twice oh my god are you serious dude Ugh. <laughs> that took way too long to need it There it is. Jesus. <sighs> the witch's final resting place. Lord Gog said the helmet was in her sarcophagus. Revenia. The dead Ashwinder. Your compatriots must have made off with the helmet. Lord Gog won't like this. Better show this to Lodgok. There must be some sort of mechanism for this doorway. Oh, okay. Hey, man. I went through so Lodgok, much for this. The sarcophagus has been raided. I found no helmet. Only a dead Ashwinder. Damn! They got here first. We need to get it before Rookwood uses it to further ingratiate himself to Ranrock. I saw one of their campsites not far from here, but I fear you must go in alone. My fighting days are behind me. That's understandable. I'll head there now. Good. There's no time to lose. Get to that helmet before Rookwood does, or we will lose our chance at any leverage, no matter how small, with Ranrock. To think those wretched thieves have their hands on such a relic. You said time for fighting? Say less. Yo, this broom has came in clutch. <laughs> oh. There they are. The Ashwinders. Rebellion. Oh, maybe I could stop it? Oh yeah, y'all got that. Explosive. Oh, you see me, you see me, okay. Are you? Shall we finish what we start now? Back for more. Expulsion! Expulsion! Come, bitch. Expulsion! Such a bitch as well. Where'd you go? Quite conductive, aren't we? <laughs> <laughs> 
bitch. You'll believe I defeated an Ashwinder by myself. Come on, they gave you some more credit. <laughs> Professor An An assignment. Wait, what was that? Did it did it go down? What was that? Okay, so we have to recover the helmets. Maybe over here. That's it. <gasps> this is for Rockwood. I'll watch the light go out of your eye. Wait, what? Y'all got finesse like that. Skadoosh. Mysterious and a bit unsettling. What to do? I retrieved the helmet from the Ashwinders. Well done. This is sure to impress Ranrock. The helmet shines even more brightly than I imagined. The etchings, the contour of the profile, remarkable. It looks stunning, Lord Gok. I see why you wanted it back. You did the thieves a service by recovering it. I know many a goblin who would have killed for it. Oh, then I'm glad to be rid of it myself. Thank you. This should earn Ranrock's trust. I will take it to him immediately. It may distract him from his search. His search? It, uh, it is merely an inkling. You have impressed me greatly, friend. I am glad that I trusted you. We Wait shall speak us. soon. Best to keep our arrangement quiet for now. Many will not believe that our aims might possibly be aligned. Wait to us, dude. Okay, let's see. I bought a shitload of stuff, or I retrieved a shitload of stuff. Uh, trash. Oh. I need shit that has, like, perks in it that are worth, uh, replacing. Okay, so... You can't imagine how inconvenient we gotta activate the pencil. <laughs> Right, was that it? Acquire all three combat plans and use them. Uh, his ability cast a pulse on. Oh, levitated. Okay, and then we'll do that. There we go. Okay, so now what do we got to do? Uh, acquire all three. Practice flying. A tank class. Okay, we could do that one. I think we're in combat. So much to do in this game, holy shit, dude. <laughs> uh, we got a shit ton of stuff. Too, 
a dash of powdered bat spleen, I think. Um, I've upstairs? I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Oh, all the way upstairs. Jesus, how high is this? It's gotta be here. Right? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, uh, what do you see? The real question is, what is in mine? assignments were challenging enough for you. I've completed all of my tasks, Professor Onai. Very well done. Although I must admit, I did have something of a premonition that you would follow through. Now, as you have no doubt sharpened your perception by completing my assignment, I am curious, based upon the knowledge that one's present and even one's past may reveal traces of what is to come. Mm -hmm. What do you see in your own future? I see triumph. Of, I sense danger. I see power. I'm not sure. There will be hardship. I'm sure of it. But I see triumph in the end. A measured perception. Very wise. Nothing worthwhile is ever easy. And that is why such futures are worth striving for. Exactly. But this talk of tomorrow should not divert us from your present success. I shall inform our good deputy headmistress of your exemplary performance. And if that performance is any omen of what your future may hold, then I, for one, see great things. Oh, yeah, dude. Channel your magic towards your targets. Whoa, 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 whoa. This the sendo, the sendo. You have it. Now, why not practice the new Rebellion. spell on the training domain? Let's see. Sendo, excellent. Oh, you have it. <laughs> oh, look at the tip of the wand. you must stop preparing and put your newly honed skills to the test outside of the classroom okay dude holy shit <laughs> that one was cool that was a cool uh uh thing uh i need to attend beast class taught by professor Hawen. Gladwin Moon, the Hogwarts caretaker, wishes to speak to with me about something. <gasps> oh yeah, 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 yeah. This one, this one, this one looks like the locksmith one. Yep, yep, yep. Need this. And it looked like the the sloth statue. 
Hopefully this is the, the locksmith one because... Uh, what's it called? I was really hoping I was going to find this today so I could, you know... I should think there's an entire grind after, after I get off. Because holy shit dude, there's so many locks and... To finish get, getting the, the, the house coins, I, I need that shit. These things right here. There we go. Oh, this dude. Hello again, Mr. Moon. Oh, I was hoping to see you again, my young friend. Uh, Gladwin Moon, a Hogwarts caretaker, at your service. First, uh, please allow me to apologize if I seemed a bit uh, unsteady when we last met. I'm afraid I had a rather disconcerting encounter. Although I hear your visit to Hogsmeade was even more eventful than mine. I suppose you could call it eventful. I certainly wasn't expecting a troll attack. Oh, of course not! And uh, from what I understand, the village was lucky you were there. In fact, my recent visit to Hogsmeade is the reason I was hoping to bump into you. I could use your help with something. What happened? Do you see that curious statue over there? Watch what happens when that light changes from day to night. What the fuck is this audio? What the fuck? Oh, that's new. Now, if you wouldn't mind humoring me for a moment, see if you can remove the moon from the statue. Oh, odd little contraptions, aren't they? It seems the statue vanishes once the moon is removed. Which, incidentally, can only be done at night. Uh, why don't you hold on to that one for now, and I'll explain more as we walk. Uh, ever since that fateful day in the village, those curious statues have begun appearing about the castle. A fair number have been strewn around Hogsmeade. Someone, it seems, is trying to torment me. You see, that day in Hogsmeade, I turned a corner and came face to face with a boggart. Or shapeshifter, if you will. Uh, which takes the form of whatever scares you most. This one took the form of a demiguise. A demiguise? <gasps> yes! Terrifying creature that can see the future. Wholly unnerving. I encountered one when I was a lad in Korea. Lewis. Terrible experience. Uh, those statues are demiguises. The moons, I assume, are an uninspired play. Revelio. Some jackanapes used a boggart to learn my greatest fear and use it against me. I have my suspicion as to the scoundrel or scoundrels responsible. It is my hope that they will slip up and reveal themselves as the statues disappear. That is why I need your help in removing the statues. Why me? A Jesus. couple of reasons, frankly. Uh, first, your daring do against those trolls in Oxmede has gained you a reputation for fearlessness. Second, as macabre and hideous as a demiguise is, most would find my fear of them unwarranted. You, however, have seen how they affect me. I'm at my wit's end, young friend. I, I simply can't bring myself to go near them. In fact, I'm Bro, why are you talking like right that? <laughs> here in the faculty tower. Uh, perhaps you could start simply by removing them so uh, I can go about my evening duties. I'd be glad to help you, Mr. Moon. Oh, I knew I could count on you. Uh, first, you know how to cast a disillusionment charm, correct? Mm. You'll want to do that before wandering the tower at night. Uh, next, you'll notice that the door is locked. However, will you get in? <laughs> Alahamora, that's how. Thank but God. What about curfew? Curfew? Oh, tosh. I sense you're a bit like me when I was your age. Oh, the school was my oyster. <laughs> and I took advantage of it. Oh, everyone loved me for it. <laughs> oh, those were the days. Uh, now, you'll find one statue in the prefect's bathroom and the other in the hospital wing. Good luck. And thank you. Oh my god.
There it is. Where is it? What the fuck? I don't even know how the fuck I did that. Well done. You're in. Remember, use a disillusionment charm so no one can die. This is a restricted area of the castle. Oh, one of these things. Revelio. Okay, so what am I looking for? Oh my god, this is gonna be so complicated, dude. Okay, okay, I got it, I got it, I got it. Butter from Syrian? Sirona? What the fuck? As Revelio reveals authority figures and enemies. Revelio. What's this? Hogwarts elves do an exception of the job. One poor elf in blue smoking, giving those of us nearby. I'm sorry, I gotta do this one first. I've been looking... Wait, where are you going? I've been looking for this thing for a while, dude. I think I need like two more left. There we go. Oh, there we go. Woo! Yeah. Revelio. <gasps> what the fuck are you doing? Okay. 
Okay, maybe... Level two. There we go, there we go. Okay, 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 okay. There's that one. There we go, there we go, there we go. W robbing! Go, 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 go! What is that? like something that we needed. There we go. Oh, I got caught. <laughs> I got caught. Oh my god. Please tell me. Oh my god, I got loot everything again. Oh my god. Okay, level two. Oh wait, no, I don't have to loot everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two people there. How are your students getting along this year? Oh, poorly, I'd say. Avelia. Oh. Okay, 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 okay. This must be the prefect's bathroom. Oh, perfect. Go, 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 go. Ravenclaw, perfect. Uh, oh, there's someone right there. Not at the moment, no. Plenty of other perils and pitfalls to send them my way, though. Well, I suppose I should begin my rounds now. Oh. I suppose Professor Black knows best, but the students are terribly disappointed. Fuck. Pavilion. Not this year, anyway. I'm partial to 
the Hufflepuff myself. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> I was finally going to learn the Quidditch rules. <laughs> what is he doing? Oh, I suppose I should pay closer attention at the next match, if there ever is one. Okay. Fuck. Revelio. Okay, 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 okay. Go, 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 go. I think I need two more left and then I'm done with this shit. And I know I know where's the the, the last one. That's by the dueling area. Yo, this shit better be fucking worth it, man. Come on, dude, go. you asked me to collect oh goodness you're as fearless as i'd hoped an excellent start uh, if we can collect more it may shed some light on who's behind all this of course i first suspected peeves he drove the previous caretaker rancorous carp to an early retirement with his intolerable buffoonery but that does not explain the bogger in oxmead does it no I am determined, with your help, to discover the identity of my tormentor. It's definitely intriguing. I'd like to help you solve this mystery. Uh, you, my friend, are a gentle person and a, a scholar. And I have something to offer in exchange scholar. for your assistance. Now, remember, the moons are only retrievable at night. Thus, I encourage you to use a disillusionment when necessary. Okay. Understood. I shall keep an eye out. I appreciate that. Oh, I, I knew you were the one to ask for help. Uh, keep at it so we can solve this mystery. Oh. Okay, so now that we got that, let's, um... I think it was right there. Let's go get the, the last key for the, the house token and let's see what. This area, yeah. This area. Oh, wait, no, I can't go in there. Wait, no, it's over here. There it is. There it is. Oh, 
please. Last token, please. Rebellion. <laughs> Ain't no way it's just this. Oh my god. How do I go in there? Fire. <gasps> oh, go, 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 go. Oh, my God, I did it. What? How do we go up there? Oh my god. I don't think I'll figure it out anytime soon. Oh, there's a lock right there. Oh, maybe there? Hopefully, dude. Okay, so the butterfly's yes. right there. Bring this bitch here. There we go. Please, level one. Thank God. Alohomora. Okay. Yes. Rebellion. I think it's here. Oh, there it is. Oh. So when it goes over here, okay. Fuck, not yet. There? Oh, the, the owl. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, there. Oh, uh, okay, okay. Now I got it. Now I got it. Dumb bitch. Here? Oh yeah, it is here. <gasps> yes. Oh my god. I really hope this is the last one. Oh my god, that's fucking creepy.
Out the door again. Uh, dragon head. Okay. Right there. That one's all right. That one's all right. Okay, looks like there's the uh, more shit. Um, What do I need? Spider legs. There it is. Let's see. What the fuck? Where was it? Oh, down here. There we go. Last, last uh, thing here. Okay, now let's see if this was worth it. <laughs> From what I saw, it's like a, it's a, like a legendary um, clothing. Where are we? There it is. Another house token for the house chest. Last Indian, one. The last house token. Time to see what's inside. Was it worth it? Was it indeed worth it? What the fuck? <gasps> the dandelion keys. Quest updated. Slither and relic goes house. To the former headmistress, you proxy them all. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hold on, let me see, let me see, let me see. Where's it, where's it, where's it, where's it, where's it? Oh, not that. Where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Whoa! That looks cool. Oh, and it's like, it's like glowing too. That's badass, but at the same time, you know? Now let's rock this one. Yeah, let's rock this one. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Um, what else do I gotta do? What is this? I need to attend B's class taught by who? All right, let's go check it out. B's class. I think this might be the first time we ever go here. Okay, hold on. Welcome, everyone. I see you've already met some of the many beasts we study in this class. Though be advised, none of these creatures should be taken lightly. They are all in their own way dangerous, especially if one does not know how to handle them properly. Now, it seems many of you are out of practice. Let's take some time to review the basics of how to care for a beast, shall we? Miss Sweeting, would you please assist our new student with the lesson today? 
Yes, Professor Howen. Hello, I'm Poppy, Poppy Sweeting. Don't worry about Professor Howen's speech. She over-exaggerates sometimes. <laughs> All the beasts in class are perfectly safe. What oh! the fuck? Miss Sweeting, pay attention, please. The tongue of a puffskin can be a slippery devil. Uh, yes, Professor. Here, you can practice on Gerald. Just keep an eye out for his tongue. <laughs> You can use my brush. Just be gentle. Oh, and think pleasant thoughts. I like to think it enriches his experience. Okay. That's lovely. I'm sure he feels much better. I think he might be hungry. Would you mind giving him some beef? <laughs> what do you suppose <laughs> the, the pellets fuck? taste like to Gerald? Pudding, I like to think. I think we can safely say that Gerald likes you. That's good news. He seems very nice. He is. Kindness is one of his best qualities, right after ambition and cleanliness. Good work, everyone. Now, let's make our way to the pens and select another beast. And please, do be careful as you feed and groom them. Miss Sweeting, why don't you show our new student to the Neasles in the farthest pen? This way. The Neasles are over here. The cats? Big chunk is cats. Oh, couple in the easel whiskers ought to get me a few canuts at least. Enough to buy something from Honey Jukes. <laughs> uh, stupid thing. Oh. Uh. oh, man. What in Merlin's uh. name are you doing? Uh, tusk, tusk, peculiar poppy. Worried about a worthless little rodent? Her name is Persephone. <laughs> Her name is Persephone. <laughs> the girl on the back, dude. Funny. Let's go. Oh, brother. Those two don't belong anywhere near this class. Coaches and training. Persephone was on to them instantly. Thank you for your help. Let's carry on. Feed and brush the measles just as you did with Gerald. <laughs> the measles really took to you. They know a good egg when they see one. As do I. Hey, yo, Shaboy. It appears our time has come to an end. Please close the pens and see yourselves out now. Where is our new student? Ah, there you are. I would like a moment, please. Where are you? <laughs> okay. What about that one right there? Don't worry, I didn't forget about you. Hey, okay. Hey, man. Hello, Professor. You wanted to speak with me? I did. How did you find your first beast lesson? Easy. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Good. You seem to understand that when beasts are properly controlled, they can play a vital role in our lives. Some provide us with magically imbued materials, if cared for correctly, which does not include torturing them for whiskers. Well done. Yeah, by that's the way. a little OD. <laughs> Probably best to let me handle it next time. Yes, Professor. They're nearly as bad as the savages in Rookwood's poacher pack. Uh, 
Sadly, we're the ones who suffer. Stumbling over dead beasts? Terrible waste of resources. Surely the poachers can be brought to justice by someone. The Ministry, perhaps. Hmm. An optimistic idea. Now, why don't we focus on more immediate matters that we can control? Professor Weasley has asked that I prepare some assignments designed to help you catch up to the other fifth years. Be on the lookout for my owl. Meanwhile, I also encourage you to study as many beasts as you can on your own time. Okay. Also, that must be the footprint. Psst. Psst. Over here. Oh, man. Was she trying to smash or something? Did you need something, Poppy? Thank you again for saying something to those brutes so that I didn't have to. You were an augury at noon in the desert. I certainly hope that's a good thing. It's something my gran and I say. It means that something or someone is a welcome surprise. At least that's what we decided it meant. I couldn't stand there and watch them harm the poor thing. We're of a similar mind. Actually, in light of that, there's someone I'd like you to meet in the forest. You've intrigued me. Very well, lead the way. I'd hoped I would. Okay, where are we going? I wouldn't take oh, just a lot. There. In fact, you're the first. Really? Well, thank you, I think. As I said, we think alike. Pleasant surprise. <sighs> Quite the well in the house. What do you think? Poppy, where are you taking me? It really is much better if I just show you. Whoa, man. Where are we going, man? Don't worry. We're nearly there. It's just ahead. Hopefully it's like the, the flying... Uh... Big things. So I could use those as, instead. Stand back. Instead of the broom. It is. It is. Woo hoo hoo. Oh, so majestic. God damn. <laughs> oh my god. Please meet High Wing. Isn't she just magnificent? Go on, introduce yourself to her. But be careful. You must always show hippogriffs the proper courtesy before mm -hmm. you approach them. The bell, right? Oh man, how how would I know that right now? Hey. Then if he bows, he accepts me. Hell yeah! Come here, little shit. I knew it. I don't think I've ever seen a hippogriff take to someone this quickly. You can feed and brush her if you'd like. I come and check on her every once in a while. Bring her pasties, tell her what's going on in the castle. You wouldn't be hey. looking at her, but she's a dreadful busybody. Oh my god, this thing is so cool. He's like a, I think his name was Haggard. Or he had one of those as well. So, what did you think of High Wing? I thought she was brilliant. Can't believe you introduced me to her. I suspected you two might get along. Are you the reason students have been seeing hippogriffs flying above the Forbidden Forest? Hmm, perhaps. Did you know that once you earn a hippogriff's trust, they'll always be there for you? I've seen it firsthand with her. How exactly did you and Highwing cross paths? It's a longer story, but I rescued her from poachers a few years back. Got her to safety and, well, she was fine until recently. You may have noticed that poachers are something of a problem in the area, so I worry they could get her again. Yeah, I found one and of them. I might not be there next time. I couldn't Professor free because... mentioned the poachers as well. I didn't have the locked in. ...that we couldn't rely on the Ministry to help. I don't often agree with Professor Howen, but on that, I fear she's right. 
The poacher's influence is growing. I see them every day in the village, lingering, talking to people. They're up to something. I'm just not sure what. Okay, this might be something I do, uh... uh, uh on my own time. Side quest. That does seem strange. Sounds as if they're planning something. Exactly. I think I'm going to look into it. Find out what's going on. What they're doing. I think that's a fine idea. Information is power. And the more I know, the better I can keep Highwing safe. Mm. You seem undeterred. Will you let me know what you find out? Oh, very well. I will. I should be going, but we'll speak again soon, I hope. Okay. Hell yeah. Boom. 23. Shaboing. Yo, it's crazy because I have almost, um, let me see, let me see. Let me see how, how much, how many hours I put into this game. Last was 13 hours, now 15 hours in the game. And I feel like we haven't even gone to like the, the crazy shit yet. <laughs> That's crazy. Hello, friend. I wonder if you might stop by the three broomsticks when you can. I would like your help with something. Okay. Who else? As I mentioned, my sister Anne misses Hogwarts. But she hasn't been herself lately. I'd like to take you up on your promise to visit her with me. I'm heading to Feldcroft soon, so I'll look forward to seeing you there. It's just south of Hogwarts. By the way, hope you're faring well with the blasting curse. It's still one of my favorites. Oh my god, I haven't even used that one. Now that you've attended Beast's class, I've asked Deke to assist you in using the room to further your studies in that regard. Please meet him there when you can. Oh, okay. I've not heard from my Uncle Roland in quite some time. I've been beside myself with worry. Could you meet me in the courtyard? Who the fuck is that? Was that the girl with the the the, the, the treasure in the lake? Where am I going now? God damn. Oh, this is Sebastian. Okay, let's let's do that one. 